what is going on guys i am toy hunter if you're new to this channel i do toy hunts unboxings the occasional comic book tv and movie review speaking of comic book tv and movie reviews you can watch my latest reaction to the avengers infinity war trailer here at the mini face pod subscribe there subscribe here and make sure you hit that bell so that way you get notified next time i drop a brand new video so on today's agenda i'm gonna head to books a million because i have a 20 percent off coupon because i'm a member they're doing like store wide off your entire purchase 20 percent off um if you're a member i think it's 10 percent off if you're not a member 20 percent off if you are a member so i'm gonna go there take advantage of that still in a hunt for Surter, still in a hunt for grandmaster when i went to core score mall with p2 they let me know that the sawgrass hot topic should have grandmaster maybe it's been a few days so fingers crossed i may have missed it like i did at the core square mall so we shall see shall we see you not it has been a while since i've been in books a million got a couple new display stacks here Let's see what else we got over here got hellboy i kind of came to look for the old long. oh I, yeah i think that's that might be a must grab right now to be honest I'm getting her regardless, but whether I get her today or not is the question. So we shall see. We'll see what else I find. Um, I know the Aladdin pops were supposed to be coming out December, so I'm wondering if they were here. I know Books a Million has either Abu or Raja flocked. And you know me, if there's a flock version of a Disney character, I usually tend to go for the flock version. So, it's just, uh, you know, just kind of my, my style, type I prefer. Plenty of Hellboys, no chases, obviously. I don't share the luck of most other people. Hmm. Yeah. It's a choice. Oh, why don't they have 11? Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Finally. Man, it's been a while. I haven't seen her in forever. Or just only on pictures. <laughs> but yeah, so apparently she's vaulted. Um, but she's one of the ones I wanted to grab regardless. So, uh, glad I got her now. I think, I think I may be done with my, uh, Stranger Things. I think the only other one I maybe, at least this whole wave, I think I'm done for sure. I think I only need Hopper, and with that, I, I really only want the chase, so. Yeah, everybody's looking for some stranger things, huh? Oh wow, they had them all up front, and I walked right past them. <laughs> I would have seen it as soon as I walked in the door. That is awesome. That is awesome. Hmm. Catwoman, I do still need Catwoman for the animated series. That's another possibility. Let's see. I was in GameStop the other day and I saw this Catwoman bombshell, but I can't really, I don't know what's the difference of this being the, uh, oh, maybe it's the stockings? That makes this different from the uh, the regular, because obviously it's a BAM exclusive. But you know, I don't know. I guess I'll figure that out at some point. Hmm. Here, bunch of the dorbs. There are tons of dorbs here. Jeez, it's a whole section. Are you paying full price for your purchase? Now you hmm. can save 10% with our million discount card. Uh, these look like basics for, and always, for the most part. Yeah. Got some discount pops here too. Yeah, nothing too special here. I'm missing. I've pretty much seen what I want so far. <laughs> 
And I don't see any of the Aladdin pops either, so tons of Bob Rosses still. See, I like this new display they have of their exclusives. Kind of makes it easier, right? See that one? Ah, so it is the stockings. Is it? No. They look the same. I don't know. If you guys know, let me know down in the comments. What's the difference between the BAM exclusive and the regular Catwoman bombshells? So, because eventually I think I will get that because she does look really cool. And you know I love my pops with glasses. Yeah, tons of Annabelles. A couple of roars. You know, this Flock Grinch looks really cool. <laughs> yeah, it does look really good. I got a bunch of them here, though. So, but yeah, no, uh, no Aladdin pop so far. But they'll be coming. So I think I'm going to get these three. Um, since I have the 20% off, and I'm a member, so I get an extra 10. So 30% off of the whole purchase shouldn't be too bad. Pretty good deal. Popped in here real quick, and they usually have nothing, but this is the first time I'm seeing NBA pops in the, uh, in the wild. So that's crazy. They got Isaiah Thomas here, and they got Kevin Durant. So that is pretty awesome. And oh, that's somebody else here. What is this? And Carl Anthony Towns. And I think it's Katie again, yeah. And that is Giannis, the Greek freak. That is really cool. That's really my first time seeing NBA Pops in the wild. That's nuts. See this anybody? No. If they had Kyrie on Cleveland, I'd get that one. That's like the only one I'd be interested in, to be honest. Because the only other ones I have are LeBron. So, because he's the GOAT. As far as legends go, they're pretty scarce here. They don't have much. This lives up to their reputation for sure. They got Groot though. So that's something. And Star Wars, they got Akbar. None of the new wave though. No Jaina Solo. I'm here and she's out. GameStop looking for Surtur, but I do not see him anywhere. Period. Let's see. I really, really, this box is weird. This window is extremely dirty. I really love this Captain Marvel, man. I just don't want that Chun Li, and I have no use for that Chun Li. Joyce. Oh, and Toby's out. And out of candy. That's dope. Man, see, my only beef with the. Uh... Oh, and I also just got uh, Wonder Woman Gauntlets today. I did not realize she was a Funko Pop, Funko Shop exclusive. And uh, shout out to P2, because, you know, P2 is the man. And uh, he hit me up and let me know that they were, and I got me one. So that's super exciting. But yeah, GameStop's always $12.99 on their pops, man. I may wait. She's a common, so I'm going to wait till she. Uh, Shows up at a Target or something. That's see, there's the flock. I'm gonna wait till they if I can get him in a trade or something. Or I'm working on a trade with him, to be honest. Uh, so maybe I'll either wait through that or maybe there's a deal or something that comes out. I don't know. Then they have these Shadow Heartless. God, I find the chase. It's probably gone already. Yeah. So there. Still have Dig Dug. Oh wow. Dag it from the Angry Beavers. That's pretty cool. That's right, yeah, the Nickelodeon ones are starting to come out. That is true. Can't wait till they do Wild Thornberries, that'll be dope. So there's Leia and everybody's grabbing the chase already. So there we go. They both look very similar though. I guess the helmet's a little different on the chase. Uh, uh, let's see. Then there's Rocco with Spunky. That's pretty cute. I always like when they add the uh, the little second figure to go with them. Like um, Mushu with Cricket. 
you know, like things like that. That's, I always think that's cool. And heifer. That is awesome. That's really cool. Right. Not seeing Sardar. Where is he? They have Ragnarok Pops, obviously, right? Yeah, glad I got her for the deal. That book's a million. And, oh, finally! Finally! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Soon after. Man, so it is full disclosure. It's been a few days. <laughs> I, uh, I was, so I went hunting for the pops that you just saw that I got at Books a Million and at GameStop. And then I went on vacation. So <laughs> I kind of, I should have brought them with me. So I could have done the unboxing and then put the video out. But, you know, life, right? Hashtag life. So I'm here now. I'm back home. Back to getting this video out to you. So let's continue and start off with the beautiful Fa Mulan. <laughs> I, oh my god, I love Mulan so much. I, I've, man, can't wait for the uh, live action. Even though they're like questioning on whether they want to do music or not. It's been, you haven't really been able to confirm whether they want to put the music in the movie. You kind of need the music in the movie. Just, just me. That's just me. Look at her. Oh my god, she looks gorgeous. The detailing, first of all, the little little hair coming up on the face, the earrings, love the flow of the dress and the scarf, love how the whole dress kind of flows to the side, how it fits too big, you know, obviously it's, it's from the movie, they're, they're, you know, mirroring it right from the movie, love the fan. She's kind of trying to pretend, because you know she, this is so not her. <laughs> you know this is so not Mulan, so it's like, yeah, this is it. This is not, this is not who she is. But uh, the, the little bun in the back, I like how that is. Oh, wow, I just noticed the flower back there, too. Yo, the detailing on this is killing it. They are killing this. So, yeah, this looks really, really amazing. As soon as I saw... This was released, I think it was the same time I found the uh, three My Little Pony chases. Um, I saw that this was coming out, I was like, alright, I'm going to wait, see where it comes out at. Luckily, books a million for the deal, got to get those deals, and you know, had to get it. Mulan, Mulan, again, Mulan, one of my favorite Disney movies, period. I, I just love it. Um, let's give, give a little compare to uh, the original. So, there we go. This is how Mulan would prefer to dress, <laughs> with and with the sword too. So you know, cause she she means business. So yeah, as there's a comparison, it looked really really good. I love both of these characters. It's the same character. I love both these pops. That's what I should be saying. But uh, yeah, I really really like this new pop. Glad to add it to the um, to the collection. And it's not. I guess you can consider it. A, to, uh, a version of the Mulan set, but there's kind of like this. It's part of the, like the princess set. So you got Jasmine. I think there's Merida, um, Aurora. Uh, I think that I think that's it. Um, and then maybe somebody else that I'm blanking on. But uh, but yeah. So I really like it. Had to get it. Glad I got it, especially for the deal. If I'm Mulan. <laughs> Next up, Catwoman, Batman animated series. Another long time, kind of a long game one. I've been. Just kind of sitting on there we go she looks so great but she's been kind of becoming a little scarce and seeing her less and less so i'm glad i was able to get her now before she just disappeared and i couldn't find her again but um again got her with the three pops i got add to the uh to the deal i got at books a million so that was really awesome i love the whip love that accessory right there and it's just again bruce tim's art nailed it and it looks just like just just like the animated series. I love it. I love it. And last but not least on my Books a Million run with my three pop deal with my 20% off. Eleven. Finally, finally. Now I haven't been able to 
confirm whether or not this one is vaulted. I just, I kind of, I think I heard it either Reddit or like Reddit on Reddit, funny enough. Um, uh, I, I know I saw it somewhere that this one was, saw it or heard it somewhere that this one was being vaulted. Maybe wrong, cool, but either way, I wanted this one anyway, especially at the season, season two of Stranger Things. Like, I wanted, like, I wanted that. And I don't even have all of the 11s. Like, I don't, I think this is my first 11. I, yeah, this is the only 11 I have. So, um, I, yeah, I like this one, I, but I also still want Bitchin' 11, obviously. Um, and then the, uh, the only other version I wanted was the Chase version of the original 11. So that's why I never picked up any of the other, um, other 11s. So that's the reason for that. But for my first 11, glad to have this one. She looks awesome. Let's open her up. There we go. She looks awesome. I'm actually, I'm actually surprised there's no blood running from her nose. Cause she's doing her, you know, telekinesis powered hand gesture, so you almost think there would be blood coming from the nose. But either way, love the love the curly hair, love the new look. <laughs> it's a really really awesome. First time you see her in season two uh, show up, it's really awesome. Love the flannel she's wearing. You know, looks like the, she looks like she's wearing boys' clothes, so as they kind of make sense. Uh, you know, the light blue jeans. You know, pretty pretty simple. Love the uh, love the cheeks. Love the uh, little rosiness they, they add to to her cheeks. It looks really cool. Looks really cool. Almost looks a little bit like um, uh, Ripley from Alien. There's a Ripley Alien pop. Um, Ellen Ripley. Uh, so that looks 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 almost similar to that. But she was cool. Really really happy to have Eleven to add her. I think so. Now I now I officially have all of the kids. Again, the only other Eleven I want is the um the uh, 11 chase the original 11 chase so but with not having that i finally have all the kids uh so that's really cool it's really cool to have keep adding to that stranger things collection so there we go boom gamestop <laughs> yes man uh it's been a long time okay i've been looking for surter have not been able to find surter finally found surter so let's open him up He looks awesome. That translucent orange looks really cool, and the brown paint for the uh, the skeletal body within looks really awesome. And they uh, also show that up on the back as well, so it looks like fully see through. Looks really really cool. That looks really really cool. And then you got his crown, his helmet there. <laughs> so if you have that uh, Thor Hot Topic pop, then you know he has he's holding the uh, Surtis Surtis helmet there, and then the. Uh, the flaming sword. I forgot what the name of it is. It does have a name, but I forgot what the name of it. Uh, if you guys know, let me know down in the comments below. Um, but yeah, but this just looks a, this is a really, really cool looking pop. Um, now, with the size of Surter, sort of probably should be probably as big as Hulk up there, um, or at the very least six inches. Uh, but they made him a regular pop, and he is taller than the other uh, pops, than you know, than your standard pops. But um, but yeah, so I guess um. That's just this is a slight, slight complaint, you know. But um, but yeah, I really like this pop. Uh, finally, right? Finally, now the only one I need from Thor Ragnarok to complete the set for me is Grandmaster, and I've been to every hot topic in my area, in my surrounding area, and have not found it yet. So I'll have to venture out, head up to a couple different towns and see uh, see if they have uh, Grandmaster there, or um, I don't know, or work through trade or something. Find find some other way to get him, but uh, but all my nearest and local hot topics that don't have Grandmaster, so he's the last last member of the Thor Ragnarok set that I need. But uh, so glad I can add Surter to it. Uh, like I said, been looking for him. You guys have probably heard me <laughs> say I've been looking for him in, like the past five videos. But uh, but yeah, so I will stop saying that now because he has been found. So there's where I placed Mulan next to Rafiki and Baby Simba. And next to the other Mulan and Mushu and Cricket. So, there we go. And, where else? Here's where I place Surtur. Next to the rest of the Ragnarok line that I have. So, Grandmaster. The last piece I need. <laughs> and then, come down here. To the kids. Where we have 11 next to Mike because, of course, who else will she be next to, right? Definitely, definitely got to have her next to Mike. And we'll head back up here where 
I put Catwoman perfectly next to Man Bat and Robo Batman. You know, got the whole line up here. So obviously missing a few villains, still need to grab those. Those will be next. So that is it guys, I will wrap this video up. Um, yeah, pretty, pretty nice haul. And for the deals, Books A Million, being a member, having the 20% off, awesome. Got, um, so basically, basically got Hot Topic, you have the three for 27, comes out like 28 and some change. And for Books A Million, being a member, getting the 20% off of uh, each pop and each pop being 9.99, I end up getting three for 25 and some change. So save a few bucks, but those few bucks can go towards, you know, a server at a GameStop. You know what I mean? So you gotta, gotta get those, always gotta get those deals. But, uh, but yeah, so let me wrap this up. Let me stop rambling. <laughs> um, as always, thank you guys for all the support. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and follow. For more content, go to toyhunter.com. I am Toy Hunter. See you on the hunt.